Alright, orange on the left, natty on the right. Who the hell we got? Who we taking? I think he's been watching Poke Games for athlete. The AVR believer. Yeah. Just wait for it. The first thing I notice is it seems Natty kind of has a response for all these guys. Except Gengar. Gengar looks pretty good here. Until the Arbeliva Terras, that is. If it is a Terra. I don't think it is. It is. It's Water Fairy. Um, well, if he's Fairy, that's good for Orange. Gengar looks pretty pretty nasty here. Uh, Porygon Z looks good, too. If he gets the right move. Like, if it plays the right move. Yeah, no, it doesn't. Oh, Alright, game start. Well, I'm Torn. 50 bucks. Torn T, baby. This makes sense. Free knock for Torn. There's nothing Lottie can do. Thunderbolt doesn't kill. As long as it's what it should be, which is AV. I think AV is the best Torn set. Pretty much all the time. Or at least a good chunk of it. But even if it's not AV, I bet T-Bolt still doesn't kill. And knocking this is nice. Knocking anything is nice. So just knock. What if it doesn't have knock, or does it? Is it guaranteed? Do y'all know what the set? It's not guaranteed. Yeah, I don't know the set. Oh, but, okay. um... If he doesn't have knock, he could U-turn, I guess. Yeah, oh, U-turn. Okay. I think that pretty much tells me that he doesn't have knock. Um, I he has tank. He has hurricane, definitely. Luster, Luster purge. purge. That does a fuckload of damage. Off the rip. Oh. Okay. No drop, though, so that's good. For orange. You said that was a lot of damage, yeah. does that mean it's specs, or does that mean you just think it's tough isn't invested? I would think it's a specs. I, I don't have a way of proving that, but that did a lot. Yeah, my timid choice specs calc is in 29 to 35. That's 29, oh no, that's a 27, so it might not be specs. It might be, um, it might be the orb that the Lotties get. Uh... <clears throat> yeah, the Soul Doom. Soul Doom. Because he didn't take any damage, but that seems like in line with a life orb hit. Because I think that's what Soul Dew is, is just a life orb where you don't take damage. Yep. He goes ledge hard. We're going to keep switching. Let's see if he has knockoff here. This would be good time to throw it out. I think going ledge hard is an interesting play. Because I feel like ledge is your win con. And taking any damage on your win con so early seems misguided a little bit. But I mean, this is a good position for orange because he can knock or he can hurricane. Hurricane's relatively free. He doesn't have a resist to flying. I mean, his resist is a miss, right? So... Sarah Ledge lives Hurricane, though, and Bitterblade probably does, like, 50 to 60, I imagine. And then he gets health back. We over Christian switches. Bleak lands straight, straight up. Oh, yeah. Jesus. He has no resist. <clears throat> and now this Weezing's low, and now uh, Tusk looks really, really good all of a sudden. Even though he had like a hard tusk counter. I think he had to stay in with ledge there. And just bitter blade to get health back. Well we're just gonna keep switching. Oh 50. Alright, yeah, there's the miss. This could be scarf. I would not be shocked if this is scarf. Fifty dollars. If it is scarf, I think trick here is the play. That's works. All right, it is Scarf for sure. This is a U-turn from Orange. He might go Serolite to try and get his boost, his speed boost from weak armor. Oh, the hell, little hills in here. What the? Hell? Wait, he's... he's in the Discord too. What the hell? <laughs> Watching. The... Well, of course, he's came to watch a Klefki's live match. It's only natural. All right, I mean, he's just taking this damage. All these guys getting chipped by Torn. No flying resist. Lucky's biggest hater had to come in and watch. <laughs> Live on recording, here you are. <laughs> the hate. Okay. It's looking pretty good. Milo comes in, Ice Shard, nothing. And now Milo activates the up, it's playing more. This, could, now Milo's this game great. could be over. <laughs> Can Natty so now do Arbolivo it? comes in, I imagine. Arbolivo sets up the... Because I'm imagining Milo's going to flip turn here. So Arbolivo's going to get its terrain. Potentially, and if he gets its terrain, then maybe you could heal up some of your lower guys. 
Arbaleva is going to invite in Gengar, and Gengar is in a similar situation to uh, Torn in that he kind of just clicks Ghost move, uh, Ghost cut some combination of Ghost and Poison and hits everything. So yep, there's the flip. Who are the Terras here? Arbo. This is Terra, and then uh, nothing on Orange's side. Huh? His Terras are Crocolore and Purian. He elected to be neither. Game's a little bit faster than I thought it was going. It's been, it's been a minute a turn. I'm just trying to decide. I think Gengar's fine. He was torn. That's fine, too. This Arbo should take this opportunity to tear up for sure. Torn and uh, Gengar are just looking so menacing right now. Wartester has no like defensive backbone, and his Weezing's at like, no HP. This Arb has to be like Max Spideff to deal with Gengar and Torn and Porygon. Max Spideff plus Assault Vest. And I don't even know if he like beats them. It probably can like eventually. Yeah, Bleak Wind. Ouch. That does a fuck load. Still a does. Well, he gets this up, I guess. That's a really huge crit. He need this to be healthy. And now it's not. But I'm assuming he has healing on it. Strength Sap or something. Or Leech Seed. Giga Drain. At least he could be nice. He's got the light screen up. This is, uh, he's angling for the Sarah Ledge, is what this looks like. I think it's a bulk up Sarah Ledge now. Light screen plus bulk up. Is my guess. I had to take a stab at it. Little Hill professional breakdown. Well, as you can see, um... Oh! Okay. <laughs> you said it, Little Hill. You said the best. As you can see, Klefki's team basically has not taken pretty much any damage. And, uh... Worcester. Worcester Whoopers. 45% Weezing. 63% Latios. 51% Arbolivia. 50% Mamoswine. Taking some major, major damage here. A solid now another 50. 50. He's trying to get like into a yeah, trick here, maybe. Oh, tough. Now he has to, and he's going to lose his screens. This is He had the trick there, and then like bait a move, and then go Sarah Ledge and set up, and that was like his only way of winning, really. Orange I'm assuming that's. Driver's seat. Yeah, I'm assuming that's the game plan. This makes sense. Yep, this is a defensive. Because he knows wheezing hard walls, this is like a defensive tusk. Makes perfect sense. And now all his screens are gone. And actually, he has the light clay, so he has three turns. <laughs> but it's not enough for the ledge, which I'm assuming is what the screens are for. Because the ledge can't find an opportunity to get in, especially on this thing. Let's see, for some reason, doubles out here in the ledge. It, very dangerous, you know. But now, like, uh, yeah, Gengar comes in, that's fine. And you get a Shadow Ball. Free Shadow Ball, because he's tarot out. This thing probably can't hit you. No. <clears throat> My DL career? Missing? Ghostly? Toxic? Dead, probably. <laughs> All right, he just defogs away the rocks. Fine. He's probably just gonna. I mean, he can't sack the Weezing because then Tusk becomes a problem. But he probably knows Tusk is defensive by now. This is a whole lot so. of neutral or defensive from Natty. A whole lot of offense, just clicking buttons from the left key. So tough. Yeah, and Natty's switching a lot, and he doesn't have the walls to be like so neutrally defensive. Like, none of these are actual walls. <laughs> They're all like offensive and he's using them defensively. Porygon Z is gonna clean this game too. He if might get six. <laughs> he might get six for Shadow Ball. Out. No prediction. It's over for uh, Rotom. For he year. probably sacks Rotom there. Or maybe he just gets Rocks back up. Yeah, if he gets Rocks back up, you have to switch. Probably to Weezing. 
Music is kind of like a hard wall, which is nice, but I mean, it's it's just tough for Natty. He has no like opening. Yeah, rocks go back up. All right, so you just get to defog here, but Gengar comes back out and clicks Shadow Ball again, and now you don't have the light screen, so I think it just kills one. I don't think there's actually a Pokemon that can take it. Yep, defog, and now Shadow Ball claims one. And then he goes back out to Rotom, and then he goes back out to... T and it might just be a repeat over and over until Natty makes the Leaf Storm prediction. Or forward calls the Leaf Storm, and like until one of them misplays. He's trying to get the Arbeliva back in those sub screens again, for sure. Yeah, he wants screens and again. And then but, just I mean, get into Rule Edge. The only way he doesn't lose a Pokemon here is by going Arbeliva. But, I mean, he would lose it the next turn, because he'd get 2 KO'd for sure. All he needs so, is my screen up. I would say really probably, I would sack Mamoswine here if I were. I think Mamoswine's pretty useless with Milo still around. Four out of these six months are special. Yeah, the reflect is completely unnecessary. Light screen's all you need. But I think Daddy. He's got a sack. I'm assuming Orange is already. I think Orange. Yeah, Orange has already picked. Click Shadow Ball. There's no reason not to. So I think Natty's realized he has to pick one. He's got a sack. Got a sack. Yeah, something. Gotta, gotta be Mamo. I think you go Mamo, you sack it, you go, uh, or he sacks this, so now uh, Tusk is looking good, and rocks are permanent when they go back oh, up. Oh, straight edge. He white Viscera Ledge, so oh, he's gonna, he's gonna reveal that he's gonna Shadow Sneak, which is, like, he's kind of open, giving him the playbook a little bit. Will we see PZ come in? Hit the I field for, sure for the first time? Arb. I think Arb would have been fine there. He, bitter Blade. There's no prediction. Alright, well, if you have Swords Dance, go for it. Because then you, you can get your weakness policy. Especially if he flips, which would be really huge. <clears throat> but then PZ comes in, gets killed. Oh. He goes Arb. Interesting. Okay. All right, so Arb's going to... He gets his Seed Sower ability. Is this Arb is going to go for light. I have to imagine. Horn comes out. Strength Sap. Oh, uh, well... Herbal Oliva can actually be pretty annoying. He gets up to light screen here. If he has knock, the torn should go for it. He nasty plots. Light screen goes up. What's the last move? Leaf Seed or Leaf what is, What's the last move could be? I'm guessing Giga Drain. Giga Drain. Giga Drain. Or Just Terra, something to actually go damage. Terra Blast. <laughs> anyway, but this torn's neutral now. So, in all honesty, it gets a kill. Or it can, he can Nasty Plot again, too. That works. If, he, if he's going to Nasty Plot again, he has to go hard Sarah Ledge, predicting it. Who's outspeeding the Torrent T? Come on. Nothing's outspeeding it, that's for sure. <coughs> Ooh. Miss. Bug. Pretty clutch miss. Uh, but Reflect just doesn't matter, so... The Reflect does very little for Natty here. Latios comes out. Another, Another miss! Ad. Oh, here it is. Yeah, this is the problem with Torn T that I had last season. All his moves miss. What's that, 150 now? Uh, I think two, yeah, 150. Alright, if this is like Calm Mind, uh, I don't know, Roost. I don't think this can get Roost still. If this is like Calm Mind, Latios, we could be seeing something going on here. Because Lottie outspeeds the rest. With the Reflect. The more we talk to him, the more it could get into his head. Or not Roost, Recover. <laughs> so you could Roost. Or he could Recover. Orange might... If, if Orange misses too many, he might just play on Till and lose that way. Unfortunately, that is an actual okay, option. Okay, now Ledge. Ledge and set up. This yep, is it. This is it. This is what you... This is it. Come on, Worcester. Don't go Mamoswine. Mamoswine's a throw. Worcester... Do the ledge! You, you you can't set up with ledge, you'll get Encore, right? Oh, he goes Rotom. If he uh, has Encore. Yeah, if he has Encore, but you have to Almost go for it. Has. it he, you, you have to go for the setup because you have no other way of winning. He has no way of winning this game without ledge sweeping. Alright, now he goes ledge. One extra Giga turn time. into ledge. Oh, uh, he wants the speed boost, he got it. Alright. Now we can... If you've got SP, those. go for it. Whatever setup move he's got, he's going for it right here. If Orange calls that and goes what? for it, oh, what the? F I key, Armor Rouge would have been better in this game. Does he have? No, uh, he, no. Had he, he, he traded Armor Rouge for Sarah Lynch. 
So, I mean, this game's actually going on pretty long now. Um, well, assuming Orange doesn't miss every move again. Uh, here we go. Dark part hey, 2, yeah. Energy oh, Ball. Oh. That did a lot. Holy. And you got a spadef drop. Yeah. All right. Does Terrorblast Terror kill? It's not Terrorblast. It doesn't have Terrorblast. Yeah. It's, it's got dual screen. Energy ball. Hard Mammo is interesting. Yeah, I think E-Turn was the right play there, because now you can go... I think Porygon will come in now. Start yeah, clicking Shadow Ball. Own. Porygon, um, that's yeah, making Porygon like, hard to all. Because, like, this could be Scarf Man. I mean, Scarf with, um... I think, Scarf with uh, Shard is kind of something, but... I, I think, what's it called? I think, uh, Milo, and then just either Recover or Flip. I, just I, I, I think Milo's the best play. Um, things could get a little iffy if he decides to Trailblaze. Um... Probably not, though. No, because he'll eat it and then recover. Orange might be. Fine. Orange also might have to be play for differential here, too, so. Porygon Z, that makes sense, too, because he can just uh, go for, like, Shadow Ball. Shadow Ball will kill this, and it'll kill everything. Except the. Uh, well, I believe it's Parrot, so there, there's a chance. <laughs> you get some hacks in there. There's a chance. All right, let's see what this duck wants to do with the Lemonade Stand. So but Doug walked up Chinese EVs. What are we doing? He could be a salt vest mammo, and then I guess like No uh, way. If he's a salt vest and Shadow Ball doesn't kill maybe, and then you can like superpower and kill Porygon. That's like some uh, one way you can get out of this, kinda. It's it's looking really hard for Natty to win this, in my opinion. For, he just try attacks, that's a boatload of damage. No not as much as I expected though. So yeah, I mean, this is his spit off wall, this arb, so that so makes sense. now he needs a pair right here, and the arb goes down, probably. Yeah, I don't think he has a reason to switch. Energy ball won't do a lot. It goes and to Cerulege. If he goes Cerulege, I feel like you can just go Milo, or even, like, Tusk. As long as, yeah, he does go hard Cerulege, okay. that's fine. He just bleak wins, this is... Okay, and well, finally, is... not behind screens, the SD is here. Just don't miss it. Yeah, no, no behind screens. Just don't uh, yeah, miss it, Torn. This could really also horrible. be a roll. Right? All right. Not... Okay, mm -hmm. it's looking kind of over now. So, yeah, that was probably one of the bad Holy turns to SD. If he missed that, he probably lost, which is pretty funny. So he had um, to, so he SD the whole time, he just didn't. He just didn't click it against Tank, yeah. I mean, I guess he didn't want to get paralyzed, or he thought, yeah... I don't know. I mean, game pair would be pretty bad, but you're at neutral, so 285 ain't yeah, bad. Yeah, I mean, he's got a pair bladed too, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, Orange is playing for a 6 so diff win here. If we're going great Tusk, we're not, we're not taking yeah, no I'm shots. On this, on this 134, if the Bitter Blade, or if the Bleak Wind missed, the Bitter Blade for sure, uh, what's it called, killed, and then he went up to full, and it could have been really bad for, for him. So, I'm surprised uh, Orange went for that, especially when Milo was relatively healthy. He could have, like, hard switched to it. But, I mean, it worked out, so... PZ comes out, and PZ is gonna get a kill. Probably three kills. Yeah, PZ is about to get three kills. I think this is Scarf PZ. Latios has a chance. Latios, you have a chance. Never parried. All right. Well, our believer lives. This match has gotten dragged out. It does nothing. Yeah, I mean, we know who's gonna win, so it's kind of like, how is he gonna win at this point? How can he turn it around? Playing for PP. <laughs> Yeah, this Arbo could PP stall all six. Stall <laughs> the all six. Be a while. I don't think it definitely does not have enough strength to have for that, right? <laughs> no. no. But it would be funny. <laughs> yeah. Can you imagine? He's just switching between his regen guy and his guy that resists. Well, Legend's got 45 more, so... Let's see what we got. Chip. 
<laughs> 44 more light streams to go. If both mods got paired there, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> This is a, uh, a funny situation. Which progress this at? He can probably, because the, the grassy terrain's gone for energy wall, he can probably, like, nasty plot. Yeah, or should you start nasty plotting right now, like... Well. It's kind of interesting if this thing wasn't light screen, reflect, terra water, like... This thing being super bulky plus strengths up, maybe even like Leech Seed or even Earth Power for Tinkaton actually could have put in work. Yeah, if it was just Leech, well, and yeah, I think it probably could have been better. I get Ship. why the light screen existed, but unfortunately, the Sarah Ledge like, didn't get the opportunity to set up it needed. Alright, this comes back out. I don't think this kills. Memo's kind of fat. Yep, bind the screen, no shot. I don't know if Mammo can kill. I'm gonna assume adaptability try attack. Oh, we double out. Crash. Crash. Oh, tough. Not even EQ. I guess he expected Torn, maybe. Alright, does this Latios have recovery? If it does, I'll scream. I think it's locked in. I think it's Specs. I think, yeah, from earlier, we were probably right. There's the spit off drop. You probably just stay in here if you're natty. You got six more of them. Better start using them. Just keep going. This thing's in a T-wave, yeah, so I'm up to you. Miss. Oh, oh big. Alright, this is probably a kill. If he needs a dip, he's gonna switch. To what? Torn? He doesn't have one. He it's a kill. This is a kill. Luster Purge is like that? Just kills like that? Yeah, it kills Tank. Well, Torn's paralyzed, so it doesn't outspeed after. So he can't go Torn and everything else will die. Unless Porygon's a Scarf. He can go Porygon, live, and then... But I don't know if he wants to do that. Probably wants to stay out of Mammo range, right? Yeah. Oh. I still think Warchester loses, but he gets a kill, for sure. So now Orange is deciding who he wants to sack. <laughs> Orange went in that div, yep. I need, he says, I need it, yep. Oh, my children. Yeah, I mean, it's unfortunate, but he does have to pick one, so it's going to be... 5-0. Can honestly be a um, a pretty tough situation. It's come for 30 IRL minutes. <laughs> oh. Believe it or not. I'm thinking of how you went to spend with them. Oh, this is New York Malamars. Give you to the top. Yeah, I'm mocking with him right now. I was like, who the hell? Oh. Jesus Christ. Alright, he's really trying to preserve this diff. I don't think he can, if I'm being honest. Needs to. Uh, my <laughs> my logic recovered. It's time. He, he, can he can switch to my logic and just recover, stall it. Does, does recover do enough? Dang. Uh, this must approach does 50 to my Lodic, I bet, especially with Burn. Alright, Torn dies. No 6 PZ. Baby. He's, he's, he's basically saying this PZ is Scarf, is what he's doing. He needs to keep this Lottie if he wants any chance of winning. And he should know that this PZ is kind of telegraphing that it's Scarf. And it probably is Ice Beam. Well, he's, he's gonna try attack. In fact, yeah. try attack probably gets three kills. Yeah, it kills those. He didn't go Arbol with you. I think I think he's... Tritech did 49 last time, so it technically was a 2 KO. Yeah, oh, the 2 KOs. Damn. Oh, it's over. It's GG. over. GG, GG. 
PZ, PZ, PZ. PZ, I shard. He's going. He's gonna go. I shard. Probably. Crit. I shard the rest of his team. <laughs> Stop it. Ouch. That's a fuckload. Holy cow. That's a bandit. I'm guessing. Bandit. Oh, yeah. get that replay. Orange is coming uh, here. Hype as hell.